Lovely, John, we just tricked you there. I've got to be reviewed, especially on the type of car. Oh. Uh, it's quite a bit heavier. Uh, especially when I learn to. Oh, Jesus. Afternoon, people. Ah, bottle opener. Uh -huh. Ah, the new one. Money ah. for a gift. <laughs> that was good. A free gift. So, anyway, um, it's Ninkasi and it's Denol. I said Denol, yeah, Denol. So, Christmas gift. 7.5%. Yeah, I think I've one of the custom it's there, Christmas film. Mm -hmm. You say Denol. I'll let you open that because you know what? I have issues with them and I'm not joking here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah. She is an expert. I've always said that, haven't I? There we go. But yeah, have a look at the bottle. It's one I used, I did today. If you watch the unboxing, there's loads more of them here. We said we'd get this one done first. Um, it's got like pills and a malt and a best red malt from Munich, which I found interesting. And also a whiskey malt. So okay. that was, I don't know whether that's the barrel age. Obviously, um, it's based on the, the, the two barrels from Belgium, which they, they, they do tell you that. It says it on there. So that's pretty much a giveaway, isn't it? Yeah. Um, it, your French is better than mine. If you want to... <laughs> um, no, I'm not going to guess it. What I will say is, I'm looking forward to trying this because I've tried a few Christmas beers and nice to see what this one's like. Yeah, obviously we were there at the weekend, as a lot of you all know. Um, we, we, we did some review, we did a review in there, didn't we? Yep. Of a, well not so much a review, but just a, an all round review. It was a great place with a great atmosphere. Um, obviously we got the glasses and the pack. We're going to go on the 33 rather than the... Yes, we are pint. indeed. <laughs> we can always load a bit more in anyway. Oh, it's not as dark as what yeah, I thought. Yeah, no, it's not as dark as what I thought. Okay, this is this is looking different to a lot of them, isn't it? It's nothing like what I thought. I don't know, I better get a quick snapshot of that, don't I? While we've got the... I, I tell you what, I'm absolutely amazed. Although now, when I look at it down there, it's looking slightly darker, but maybe it's in my head, I don't know. It's not as dark as a lot of them, is it? No, definitely not. Which is good, because I, I don't know, for me, as Michelle will tell you sometimes I get strange with darker ones, no. <laughs> you get a little bit put off by the darker colour beers, yeah. I do have issues sometimes. Well, quite a few issues <laughs> and one of them one of them being with darker beers. But I mean it has a little bit more. That's a that does look alright, doesn't it? Yeah, this is this is a dark amber colour. Um it's not it's, it's quite near. clear. There isn't there isn't really a haze to it either, is there? No. It, it's very, very moderate carbonated mm. it's really not like when you had your left winter fried and say the carbonation was very well a lot of that can be nucleated glass yeah these are not nucleated oh god there might be a little bit of nucleated shame on that one i don't know about that one i can't see now anyway right go on then after the okay, evening go see what we're getting what are we getting we're getting a christmas beer we know that much ninkasi de oh, yeah you've got sweetness there and i'm picking up on the spiciness Maybe a little hint of fruit in there. It's it's got it's got your, your roasted malt. You, you know straight away. I don't know whether it's, it's gonna fig, be, you know. Mm, I don't know. Um, those, those kind of Christmas spices that you usually pick up. The toasted on. bread. Mm. You, you, I don't know. Not, there is a sweetness. Is it? You always if one always, always says it's caramel. Maybe. I never get the caramel caramel that everyone gets. I just don't. <laughs> to me, it does it. smell caramel like. Um, I get it in the taste sometimes, but not so much. My sense of smell just doesn't give me caramel. Think, oh, yeah. And I really do like caramel, so don't get me wrong. Maybe I'm, even um, yeah. There's a hint of fruit in there. There's something. But it is fruits, apricot, banana. 
Yeah, so I'm not getting anything like banana. Yeah. I know banana when I get banana. Yeah, it's not like the, the pungent banana smell that you no, get from it. Yeah, yeah, it could be some different stuff. Oh, maybe it's, it's, you know. Okay, let's go. Let's try this. Go in and it's, it's, all you can do with something different is go in and see exactly what you're getting. Try that. <laughs> no, try it. Because I'm trying to get something out of a rise It's here. not as I would have expected from what you were saying. Coffee. You're picking up on coffee. Chocolate. I'd agree with the chocolate um, sweetness in there. There's also a kind of biscuity quality yep. to that. It has got the malt. Um, yeah, it has got biscuity malt. You know, like the oh, cheesecake base. It reminds me of that a little bit. The, the sweetness on the front end. Um, Those are like coffee taste, definitely. I am getting a little bit of cinnamon, nutmeg. A yeah, little cinnamon. I could go along with cinnamon. That. A little bit of pepper, but what I'm finding surprising with this, where they're saying there's whiskey in it or they use ingredients, it whiskey, no, but might be just yeah, whiskey malt. Or something. I really expected that kind of taste to be there. It's not, it's a lot softer than that. Yeah, it does have a slightly smoky finish to it, which I think is complementing. Dry, yeah, it's, it's smoky, it's smoky and dry. And it, that for me is where the contrast lies that really balances out nicely that sweet taste at the beginning. Hey, it's nice on the mouth, Bill. It's because of the whiskey thing. You said that you didn't think I'd like that very much, wasn't it? There was a couple of things. The coffee thing, which I'm picking up, but you're I'm not. I'm not picking up a great deal of no, coffee No, not a great deal, there. but there's, there's coffee running through it. But it's nice. Let me you know, like, try to see if I'm picking up any notes of coffee. You know, like um, a nice, like we, we your roasted malt are giving off that coffee. Mm. But not like coffee where it's like, a stout, you know, where sometimes when you have a stout and it's bang smack on and it does your head in sometimes the coffee. But the coffee's light and it's nice. It's the coffee along the lines of, of the milky coffee, you know, with the sweetness from your cinnamon, your caramel. Yeah, I, th I think there is maybe a tad of it in there, but it's really subtle and it's blending really it's nicely nice. with the other flavours that are in there. Quite surprising. Yeah. I'm, I'm really quite surprised with this. I didn't expect it to be like this. To be fair. I didn't know. I, I I wasn't sure. You have to wait, Tiger. Sorry, but it's a so, dog's off, by the way. He wants to go in. That, the the flavours that you are getting in there is is really nicely blended. They work well. They complement each other. A, there, there and is, it does give you a nice warming. It doesn't feel harsh. The alcohol is quite well hidden in this, isn't it? I was going to say that the seven point five is absent without leave as it, well. It, there isn't which a is harshness at all to this. Always nice tonight. Dogs. <laughs> it's like the dogs are like having a merry-go-round. One's in, one's out. One in, back, one out. So. Yeah, they kind of missed us. Um, they? You know, people do miss us. You know, sometimes, isn't it? I kind of miss the reviews though. Isn't it? Doing the proper review. Obviously, it actually feels quite nice to be here. I was earlier on thinking, oh, I'm not sure if I will do a review. I've been up really early this morning, been on a flight and whatnot. But I was going to do it on my own, so um, she jumped. I did the unboxing on my own, but then it's it's quite difficult when you have two. I get in the way. When he's trying speakers. to... Uh, well, you get in the way on the reviews, <laughs> but they seem to prefer you to me, you know, there's certain people in a way. He's left-handed and I'm right-handed, and when we try and work together, moving things around and placing them, it, it doesn't go well for us, does yeah. it? But, yeah. Are you picking up any hint of fruit in there? I'll tell you another thing. Liquish. But the, the, the dry finish, totally. There's a, there's a, there's a lovely, yeah, it's roasted, a bit toasty. Of what's the other peppery. word? It's, it's, it's a smoky, yeah. Earthy, That's what it is. What smoky. You use that a lot. It's that. That is, um, that is a nice way to describe the, the finishing notes of this. But it's good. It just quite surprised me, you know. I mean, some Christmas beers, the thicker ones, can feel a little bit, um, a little bit heavy. This is quite refreshing. It's, it, yeah. it's got a it's, mild to moderate carbonation. Yeah. For the for the seven point five, it's light. It's good. It's it, it, yeah. It, it, that's the other thing I was talking about. Where I said it didn't feel harsh in your mouth or when you're swallowing it, Some but it does do. give you a nice warming feeling, which I think is lovely for beers this time of year. See, Pilsner, as I read earlier, Pilsner, Pilsen, Pilsen, 
Best Red, Times Malt, Munich, Cara Munich, and Whiskey. So there's Ooh. some different malts that, yeah, biscuit. And do you know what? The funny thing is, she said banana. A banana is written in French on the notes. Biscuit, e spices, which means spicy, which we 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 both got. There was and yeah, that's banana like, was actually written I, there. I was saying apricot banana. You yeah. get quite. See, slight. I didn't get that. Um, that's what I was trying to taste in the taste. I think there might be a, a subtle amount of, of maybe that flavour in there as well. Oh, banane, as they say in France. But yeah, no, I don't know. We've got a school ticket. I don't think we have them, do we? I've got my one here. Oh, have you haven't got my one as well? Mm, no. no okay, okay. <laughs> Can you have a look Unfortunately not. Aha, I've got it, I've got it. Where would I be without my school card? I think it's going to be quite a difficult one. <laughs> uh, no, I'm, I'm, I thought this was going to be school, though. I just, when you start saying I'm really not going to like it. Well, I just read whiskey on the side there. Um, I don't know, do I? Yeah, I'm not a big whiskey fan. Like, but I just don't enjoy it that much. Um, yeah. As far as Christmas beer goes, it's you know what? Rate my beer of eight I was just me. about to jump up from seven to eight. It is. It is. It's a nice blend of flavours that complement each yeah. other really well. It's a fair And refreshing, eight. not too heavy. But still with a nice warming feeling for this time of year. Yeah. That's that's always a nice a nice thing to have. That's delivered. It so, has. Well done. Yeah. And Cassie, yeah. great to well meet done. you all <laughs> in Leon at the weekend. If any of you ever watch this, you probably won't. Probably don't even remember the name of the channel, but you never know. Anyway, what can I say? It's a bonjour from PJT and Michelle. And from me too. Thanks for bye watching. Bye.